the Dark Angel, Royal 57, and welcome to Undertale. Now, I know this has had a lot of popularity recently, but I have intentionally not looked anything up, just so I kind of have a fresh, new experience without really having a heads up on what's going on. Name the fallen human. We are Dark Angel. Yes. Shaky. Alright, so I will admit I have played up through this flowers thing. Simply because my audio wasn't recording, so I had to start. Howdy, I'm Flowey, Flowey the Flower. <laughs> Why'd you make me introduce myself? It's rude not to act like you don't know who I am. Someone ought to teach you proper manners. I guess little old me will have to do. Ready? Here we go. See that heart? That is your soul. The very culmination of your being. Your soul starts off weak but can grow strong if you give it lots of old. What's old stand for? Why, love, of course. You want some love, don't you? Don't worry, I'll share some with you. Down here, love is shared through little white friendliness pellets. Are you ready? Move around and get as many as you can. How about no? Hey, buddy, you missed them. Let's try again. Okay. Is this a joke? Are you brain dead? Run into the bullets. The friendliness pellets. No, they'll hurt me. You know what's going on here, don't you? You just wanted to see me suffer. Duh. And this is as far as I've seen. What a terrible creature torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Ah, do not be afraid, my child. I am Toriel, caretaker of the ruins. I pass through this place every day to see if someone has fallen down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. This way. The shadow of the ruins looms above, filling with determination. HP fully restored. Okay. Ooh, and save. Welcome to your new home, innocent one. Allow me to educate you in the operation of the ruins. The ruins are full of puzzles, ancient fusions between diversions and door keys. One must solve them to move from room to room. Please, adjust yourself to the sight of them. To make progress here, you will need to trigger several switches. Do not worry, I have labeled the ones that you need to flip. Stay on the path. Okay. Yeah, I'd say that's pretty well labeled. Splendid! I'm proud of you, little one. Let us move to the next room. As a human being living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You will need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Stall for time. I will come to resolve the conflict. Practice talking to the dummy. 
you encountered the dummy. Dummy looks like it's going to fall over. Okay. I thought I was supposed to talk. You won. You earned a zero XP and zero gold. Uh, the dummies are not for fighting. They're for talking. We do not want to hurt anybody, do we? Come now. Well, it didn't give me an option. There is another puzzle in this room. I wonder if you can solve it. I did not understand what you said, but was flattered anyway. That is an evil glare. You won! The western room is the eastern room's blueprint. Okay. Alright, so let me go take a look at that again. So do we start at the bottom or the top? Let's start at the bottom and see how that goes. This is the puzzle, but here, take my hand for a moment. Puzzles seem a little too dangerous for now. You have done excellently thus far, my child. However, I have a difficult request to ask of you. I would like you to walk to the end of the room by yourself. Forgive me for this. go on infinitely and if I like go back no greetings my child do not worry I did not leave you I was merely behind this pillar the whole time thank you for trusting me however there was an important reason for this exercise to test your independence. I must attend to some business, and you must stay alone for a while. Please, remain here. It is dangerous to explore by yourself. I have an idea. I will give you a cell phone. If you have a need for anything, just call. Be good, all right? Hello, this is Toriel. You have not left the room, have you? There are a few puzzles ahead that I have yet to explain. It would be dangerous for you to try and solve them by yourself. Be good, alright? Playfully clinking through the leaves fills you with determination. HP fully restored. Save. Okay. Wimson approaches meekly. Console. Halfway through your first word, Winston bursts into tears and runs away. Ribbit, ribbit. Excuse me, human. I have some advice for you about battling monsters. If you act a certain way, or fight until you almost defeat them, they might not want to battle you anymore. If a monster does not want to fight you, please use some mercy, human. Ribbit. So, what if I do just stay in this room? Say hello. This is Toriel. You only wanted to say hello? 
Well then, hello? I hope that suffices. <laughs> This is Toria. You want to know more about me? Well, I'm afraid there's not much to say. I am just a silly little lady who worries too much. This is Toria. Huh? Did you just call me Mom? Well, I suppose. Would that make you happy? To call me Mother? Well then, call me whatever you like. After I just call her mom, there's a flirt option? Why not? Huh? Oh! <laughs> How adorable! I could pinch your cheek! You can certainly find better than an old woman like me. Pam's my flirt again. Oh dear! Are you serious? And after you said you wanted to call me mother, are you, you're an interesting child. <laughs> um, okay, say hello again. This is Toriel. You wanted to say hello again? Salutations. Is that enough? <sighs> so... Do I obey her? Do I just wait here? Whee! Uh, this is Toria. Are you bored? I should have given a book to you. My apologies. Why not use your imagination to divert yourself? Pretend you are a monarch. Rule over the leaf pile with the fist of iron. Can you do that for me? <laughs> I'm going to start getting irritating. This is Toria. Hello, my child. Sorry, I do not have much to say. It was nice to hear your voice, though. This is Toria. Hello, my child. Sorry, I do not have much to say. It was nice to hear your voice, though. Does anything happen if I stay in this room? To the Googles. Okay, apparently nothing. It says, take one. Take a piece of candy? No. He decided not to take some. I'm in a strange place. I'm not going to start grabbing food. doesn't understand, but was flattered anyway. Seems reluctant to fight you. Mercy. Spare it. Hello, this is Toriel. For no reason in particular, which do you prefer? Cinnamon or butterscotch? Butterscotch. Oh, I see. Thank you very much. Hello, this is Toriel. You do not dislike cinnamon, do you? I know what your preference is, but would you turn up your nose if you found some on, on your plate? Right, right. I understand. Thank you for being patient, by the way. I can 
console you. You leave. Please don't step on the leaves. Got it. Wow. A pair of rockets. Oh. Should be able to get through this without hurting anybody. So I already hurt that dummy, but it was too late. Mold small. Flirt. You wiggle your hips. It wiggles back. What a meaningful conversation. Burbles quietly. Imitated? You lie immobile with Mold Small. You feel like you understand the world a little better. <laughs> Let's flirt with it. Slime sounds. Oh! What if I check it? Okay. Curviciously attractive, but no brains. <laughs> okay. Oh! I was not over quite far enough. terrorize it. Being nice to everything. Didn't you read the sign downstairs? <laughs> oh, this is kind of going to get annoying. Can I just immediately get right off the bat? Mercy. Whoa there, partner. Who said you could push me around? Hmm? So you're asking me to move over? Okay, just for you, pumpkin. Hmm? You want me to move some more? Alright, how's this? Hmm? That was the wrong direction? Okay, I think I got it. Was that helpful? Yes. Hmm? You wanted me to stay there? You're giving me a real workout. Thank you! Knowing the mouse might one day leave its hole and get the cheese. It fills you with determination. This cheese has been here quite a long time. It's stuck to the table. Boo! Oh, it's sleeping. Are they gone yet? This ghost keeps saying Z out loud, <laughs> repeatedly pretending to sleep. Move it with force? No.
this is Toriel. Hello, my child. Sorry, I do not have much to say, but it was nice to hear your voice, though. Okay, so I can't do anything with that. Can I say thank you? No, but I can get attacked. Flirt. And mercy. Woo! I got a gold. Aren't things easier when you just ask? Forgot about that. Head back to where that first frog was. And take the other path, because I don't want to be mean and make the ghost move. Mercy. And while I'm doing that, I guess I'll call the episode here. Been recording for a decent amount of time. I hope you guys are enjoying this. I am so far. If you are, give me a thumbs up, give me some comments, let me know how I'm doing, give me some suggestions. I'll see you all in the next episode. Until then. Until then, bye bye